Hi, this tutorial is to help you convert raw files into JPEG files or any other format very, very fast. Basically, you go into Photoshop like so, click on File, Open, and you find the location where all the pictures are. In this case, either you highlight from bottom to top, and you click on Open, or if you press Control A, it'll highlight all the pictures, then click on Open. Since I have a lot of pictures, this might take a few seconds. Your experience should be much faster. So I have 1,463 pictures, so that's why it's taking a little bit of time. So I'm most probably gonna end up fast forwarding this video. So you're not gonna wait for the whole thing to start. So now that it's finally open, as you can see on the, on the left, you have all the pictures loaded. So you could click on Select All. Now that it's select everything, all you need to do is click on save images and then go through this menu to choose first of all here which folder you want the files to be saved to so we'll go into this folder click select if you have any specific name that you want the document to be called you can type it in here or you can choose one of these different options if you'd like in addition you have extra different uh, tags that you can do. You can have JPEG, DNG, TIFF, PSD extensions, so all depending on what you want. Same thing here in terms of the format. Resolution is from 1 to 12, 12 being the highest. Uh, if you need to resize your pictures, you can choose that here. If there's any specific size that you want to have. In this, in this scenario, I just want to show you how fast it is, so <clears throat> click on save. And right over here, it says 1462, and uh, it's going to be going through them one by one at a pretty fast pace. If you go to the folder, test one, as you can see, they're getting done pretty fast. So this is the fastest way I find to get any pictures done. The alternative way to do this is as follows. So let's cancel this. And the other way to do this is click, you click on File, Scripts, Image Processor. Now you choose the folder that the pictures are in. Choosing the folder where you want it to save. Again, choosing the resolution, so we will do 12. You can resize if you'd like. I won't in this case. You can also save as PSD or TIFF. It appears that you can do th three different things at the same time. You can put in some copyright info if you'd like, and then click on Run. Problem with this is this is actually going to load every single picture uh, one by one while saving it. So now if we go here, As you can see, it's being done. However, every single picture has to load, which I find is very, very long of a process and will take, I would imagine, close to double or triple the amount of time than what I proposed. So those are the two options available through Photoshop. If this video helped you in any way, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel as I'll be posting more videos. Thanks so much for watching and have a great one.